Hola mis conejitos, como estas? Me llamo Alicia. Hello my bunnies. How are you? My name is Austin and today we are playing Lights, Camera, Curses! I just, I can't help doing it like that. It's just, it's so... I don't know why I end up following the stereotypical stuff. <laughs> Yes, we are snooping in Arthur's office for some weird reason. Okay, so we have three things to find in here. We have this. The safe is locked, naturally. Naturally. Lonnie Manella, could you say that just one more time? Okay, so what are... There we, there we go. There's something back there. I need to raise these blinds. All right, and what's in here... The third crate here contained that decoder, but what's this Valley of the Kings one? I'd better head over to Stage A to find out. Right, and we will, but we need to finish snooping. What is this? The combination is plain to see. Ah, so we get a look at the plane, do we? Ah, oh, gosh dang it, I messed up the bonus. Cool, it opened a secret piano. Really? Where? Was it this? Um. Oh, right there. Something back there. This must be the code to the safe. Alright, let's see. Left is Sammy's birthday. Right is. Treasure Island volume and left is the coat inspector. Ooh, I think I know what the coat inspector is. Coat inspector! Let us a look. Number 37. So we write down 37. Um, books. We would go look over here. Volume number nine. And left is Sammy's birthday. I imagine it would be somewhere on his desk, but I guess not. Um, calendar? There we go. Sammy's birthday is the 21st. Alrighty, Dighty. So now. Um, we do Sammy's birthday, then we do Treasure Island, and then we do a dare, a boyar, and now we can open the safe. What's in here? What's all this? Hmm, maybe I should try out this phone number. And maybe take the bolt cutters? Oh boy. Let's see who we call. You've reached the office of Lydia Lynn, Tinsel Town Tatler. The jerk! Journalist. Leave a juicy message after the beep. That was interesting. Jerk! Traitor! So wait, maybe it is him. Wait, I don't understand. I thought we were able to choose the vi the villain in the games, in in this one. Maybe it's just the second one. Oops, I just spoiled it, didn't I? All right. Uh, we. I swear I just saw one of those paint cans glitter. Okay, so we have four things to look at. TV is obviously one of them. That is one of them. Um, hello? Little glittering. There we go. And last but not least. Awesome. No, we gotta open it. Aw, what'd I just do? Hmm. 
turn this on first. Scene 73, take 04. Guess I'm looking for box 73. Alright. Oh, and there's 73. This is the crate from the manifest in Arthur's office. Yep. So, how do we open it? This? There we go. Valley of the King's set. Maybe the Ark? What does that mean? This prop is so light, I bet I can move it. No dir. There's the shovel. Let's lift this. Now we can get to the set. Something tells me though that there we go. I need to move this sand. The there we go. Here. What is so special about the Ark? Well, let's A look at it. Lock. A coded lock, of course. So, Naja Haje is what it's known by among scientifics. Another name has been applied. Enter it using hieroglyphics. Okie dokie, Smokey. Um, it's Egyptian Cobra, I believe. So, E is this little bugger right here. So we're putting that in. G looks like a feather duster. Y looks like a person sitting down. Or person meditating, rather. Where is it? Where'd it go? There it is. Uh, P. This guy. T. Is a woman's kneeling. Or sitting down. Sitting on her knees. I is the bird. A looks like the little flower sort of thing. Um, which I used to think was I. I think that's because of uh, the one of the Nasidra games, Tomb of the Lost Queen. N is the I. C. O is the double eyes. B is this little weird looking thing. R. Uh, this, and then lastly, Booyah. Alright, so what's in here? This is the lockpick I need to get into that sarcophagus under the main street house. I think it's time for a little powwow. And here we go. Four well, people. Well, the gang's all here. Well, not entirely. Where have you been? Believe it or not, I was actually worried about you. As well you should have been. I was hiding from Mr. Spy Cam here. You talking to me? Who else would I be talking to? George, I saw... Your interesting room service bill. <laughs> your scorpion collection. Well, yeah. The lowest Manson research on your computer. Nope, that was Molly. Uh, the photos you took of Molly behind her back. Molly? Yeah, right. Your makeshift photo lab. I saw your makeshift photo lab along with the photos of Ida you took behind her back. Or should I say, of her back? You were snooping in my room? She's a detective, freak lips. How did you know she was a detective? I told her. I was trying to calm her down after. A snake was put into her locker. Was it a scorpion? After someone put that snake in her locker. Someone put a snake in your locker? Apparently taking pictures of me wasn't enough. I did not put that snake in your locker. Come on, who else would have done it? Actually, you. Hey, look, Ida may not be my favorite person, but I would never risk traumatizing her like that. It would jeopardize the picture. Probably sure, true, uh -huh. but that snake wasn't meant for her. It was meant for me. While I was checking out that video chip, you shoved that snake into Ida's locker. You knew the wardrobe room would be my next stop. After... After I saw the cloak, 
on the video chip. You knew it'd That's be my right. next stop after I saw the cloak on the video chip because you'd already seen that it was missing from the reference model. You let all the reptiles out of their cages too, just in case I somehow missed the snake. Ew! Oh my gosh, you're both freaks! You tried to scare Nancy off the case? She realized I actually knew what I was doing and was afraid I might somehow... Um... Oh, that's right, because she's trying to find the lost footage, too. And was afraid I might somehow keep her from finding that lost footage. You broke into your own prop room to make it look like someone else took that flesh boom, didn't you? And you tried to frame me for the snake stuff with that stupid swizzle stick. Okay, okay. So maybe the idea of finding that lost footage made me do things that were a little excessive. But I never used any of the flash boom because finding the entrance to the original Pharaoh set is impossible. And I never put anybody's life in danger like you did. Since when is feeding a cat a threat to anybody's life? I'm talking about the accidents. Oops. You're the reason that black cat's always running around distracting the crew? I just thought it would hype the Lois Manson curse rumor that I... sort of started. But so what? Curses are great publicity. The tinsel Brother. sounds like I've it up Kidding me? Sort of called them and told them about it. But that's nowhere near as bad as what peeping George here has been doing. I was taking pictures of that mark on your back. What mark on my back? The one that's just like the mark Lois Manson had on her back. The one that meant she was cursed. There really is a curse, people. Seriously, mate, you need to shut this production down before history repeats itself and somebody gets killed. You moron! That's a scar from a tattoo I had removed when I landed this part. You actually believe in curses? You're darn right I do. Hey, I look what happened to the so people who opened the tomb. Brother. Alright, that's enough. The ancient enough! Run, hide! The big bad curse is... What? Just <laughs> go to your rooms and get a good night's sleep. All of you. Now. We've Thank you, Dr. Bolle. I mean, Arthur. You know, Mr. Hitchens, something Ida said earlier has been bothering me. All these accidents, yet no one's been hurt. I think I know who's been causing them. I think you do, too. Ida was right about publicity. The surest way to create a blockbuster is to get the media talking about the picture before it opens. Oh, gosh, so dang it, you it caused is Arthur. the accidents, taking care that no one got hurt, but instead of reporting them, you closed the set. Knowing word would leak out anyway, and that all the secrecy would attract lots of media attention. Correct. But from what I just witnessed, I'm afraid this film is headed for catastrophe no matter how many mishaps I arrange or how much publicity they generate. No, only one thing can save me from financial ruin. That lost footage. Please, Nancy, Find that hard to believe. You must find it. I don't know. I really do think that the lost footage isn't going to be any help because I still think that the remake will be pretty good. I don't know. I guess it all depends on what the public thinks, which is hard to do, huh? Well, anyways, editing time because I know you guys don't like this stuff. Um, oopsie doodles. Ah, Sarah's like, come on. There we go. Go there we go. Awesome. Frick! <sighs> I did such a lousy job that time. And I've been working on piano tiles too. Time to revisit that sarcophagus and try out this new lockpick. Oh yeah, that's right. Ooh, yee! Guys, is it possible I could finish this game in just this recording? Possible. Oh, we have to relight all those candles. Alright, well, let me try to find them all first. Um. There's one here. There's one here. There we go, and now the matches are right here. Okay. 
Come on, baby, let's go. Pick up the pace here. Uh! Come on. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yes! Okay, cool. And now we use the lockpick. And of course, we're going to have to do that mini game. Yep, that's what I thought. Oh, and it's actually showing me the... Okay, that's cool. Um, so let's do this here. Um, and I guess... Wait, one, two, three, four. There. Um, there. 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 Oh yeah, this is slightly working. Ah, uh, there we go. Awesome. Um, shoot. Okay. Um. Oh no, I ruined it. Wait, no, no, uh. A derp, derp. A derpy, derp. Derp, derp. The derpy, derp. Okay, so I got that one. Uh, dump. Oh no! Yes! Okay, thank you. That saved my patootie. <laughs> there. Okay. There. There. And freaky doodles. Um. No. Um, wait. Oh, uh, shoot! No! Ah! It's awesome! Okay. Oh, that was really weird. Oh boy, I guess I have to climb down through this sarcophagus. Oh, come on, Nancy. You've gone through dirtier. Gone through creepier, too. As long as someone doesn't shut the sarcophagus on us, I think we're good. All right, Nancy. Crawling down Dark. the ladder. The passage is blocked, but it looks like someone's been using flash boom to get deeper underground. This is my chance to finish the excavation Interesting. and find that lost footage first. These are the rocks you will need to blow away. Up here are the colored bombs you will use. Click the mouse to drop bombs so that they're adjacent to a rock. You need to group together at least two bombs and a fuse of the same color around a rock to blow it away. Try doing this now. Alright. Alright, cool. Great, you blew up a rock and caused the rocks in your meter to explode. When all the rocks in your meter are gone, you beat the level. Don't stack up any bombs or fuses past the top of the play area. Or you'll need to restart the level over. Yeah. One more thing. Don't set off an explosion that's not next to a rock. Don't, doing so will cause more random rocks to fall into your playing field. Oh, boy. Alright, so... Oh! It's moving on its own. Um, okay. There we go. Let's do this here. Um, here... Oh, that's right. The fuses don't last long. Um, here. There we go. There we go. Um. We need... Ugh. This is frustrating. Okay, here we go. Booyah! We need... There we go. A yellow. Alright! Booyah! We're a year quicker with the matchbook! Booyah! Ha! What your jaw? I really want to know what would happen if I get that full level. Whoa, where am I? I need to find a way to light up this room. Right? I'm betting... Ooh, what's this? Great, I can turn my flashlight on. Awesome. 
Oh, snappy doodles. Move the reflective surfaces in the right order. Okay. Oh, and it resets. Oh, boy. Nope. Oh, no, it's... Um... Um... Am I even doing this right? Um... 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 N ah. Oh, dude, wow, I got it! Cool. Let's I got it on the first out. freaking try. No, I want to know what this is. I can see something in here. Let's, let's, let's look. Audio diary! Yeah! This is the f I think this is our first audi audio diary that we found. This is disappointing. You found a gramophone record. record. You can access it from your journal under notes. By the way, we were able to find those audio diaries throughout the game. For some reason, we haven't found one until now. Alright, so we have 17 things to look for. Oh boy. Um. Do not know what everything is then. Oh, these poles. Duh. Uh. This is reminding me of another game. Are you Nancy Drew fans understanding what I mean? Um, hello? Last train, the Blue Moon Canyon. Does this ring any bells? It was a cave of something. All right, so what does it say? You've made it this far. There's only one thing left. Remove Lois from your path to see the truth. I've left you one more clue to be your guide. First Lois flies with the grace unrehearsed. Next Lois quenches through the desert's deep thirst. Thirdly, she creeps and she cur scurries and stings. And lastly, she honors the deaths of great kings. Okay. That sounds like a clue for those poles. So... Flies with a grace and rehearse. So I guess that's going to be a bird. Uh, quenches the desert's deep thirst. Cactus. Uh, creeps and she scurries and stings. It's going to be a scorpion. And lastly, she honors the deaths of great kings. I think that's going to be Anubis. I think. Oh, hey. I knew I was missing one. Oh, and a third one, second one. Oh, and a third one. Okay, am I missing anything? Oh, yep, there's one. Um, so I'm missing two. There is one. And come on. Oh, there it is. Okay. I uh that's the pyramid. Okay, so Lois is a bird. We need to find L for bird. No. 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 Where is it? Where are you? There it is. Remove. Uh, oh, it would be the cactus. I'm sure I've already found it, but let me look at everything to make sure. Uh, no, 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 oh boy. Wait, there aren't very many ones with, oh! Let me look at all of them again, because I think I might have missed something here. 
I L O O. Oops, I'd better try this again. Oh, freaking kidding me? Come on. I thought that was it. All right, let me look again. I have to relook at all of those all over again. That is frustrating. Okay, so this is obviously true. 